hi guys welcome back to another video i'm fit uchukuo so if you are new here you are welcome if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much for coming back to watch my video in today's video i'm going to be making a greasy pepper soup if it sounds like what you're interested in please stick around so these are the main ingredients i'm using for this recipe so this is my goat meat i'm using this goat meat here i'm also adding fish smoked fish then my scent leaf and i'll be using small crayfish this small crayfish then these are my spices i'm using this one this long one i don't know what it's called and the calabash nutmeg then my melon that's the main base for this soup then my big crayfish my scotch bonnet pepper my um, periwinkle also my seasoning cube so that's my seasoning cube my seasoning cube over there so these are the main things i'm using for this recipe so first things first let's boil our meat cook it very well till it's soft So while my meat is cooking, it's time for me to blend my melon. So I'm going to watch it first and then add it to my blender and I'm going to add crayfish to it and then blend it till it's really smooth. So guys, next is for me to just prep my fish, the bone it wash it make sure it's clean so that i can add it into the soup So I'm adding my melon to the pot now. Next is to blend my pepper and my spices. That's the calabash nutmeg and this long one. So I'm just going to take a pinch out from this one. I can't use everything. So I'm just going to break a pinch out from it. It should not be too much. Just make sure you are able to gauge your spices you are using so that it will not be too much inside. And I'm blending it together with my pepper so i'm going to add my meat now my cooked goat meat i added more water to it make sure your melon is not thick it's not too thick because when it boils out it's going to be thick so at this point it should be light so i've added my blended mix my fish and now i'm just going to add the rest things my crayfish and cover allow to get to a boil So while my soup is boiling, I'm going to prep my scent leaf because this is the last thing I'm going to add to this soup. So I'm going to prep it now, slice it and keep it aside. So now I'm adding my seasoning cube. You can use any seasoning cube of your choice. It depends on what you are comfortable with. So I'm adding my salt now. And my periwinkle is coming towards the end of this soup. I don't want my periwinkle to be soggy. So it's coming at this point. And after this, I'm adding my scent leaf. And after now, I'm going to cover it and allow it to just absorb the scent leave the aroma the flavor everything absorb it then i can stir and my soup is ready so if you are still with me up until now i don't know what you are waiting for if you've not subscribed 
please subscribe and give this video a thumbs up okay give the video a thumbs up so that i will know that you like the video and it will motivate me to do more of this type of video thank you so much so guys our food is ready mama don't cook finish your food don't ready now time for us to chop so it's time for me to go and eat i want to eat this soup with my preferred swallow that is um cassava flour so you can use any swallow of your choice to eat this you can use stash you can use semo you can use anything you like to eat it thank you so much for watching see you in my next video lots of kisses Mwah.